rejoice evermore. Jesus went into his own, and his own received him not. The Jews put him on a cross. That's where he died for all the sins of the world. They took him down from the tree, buried him in the sepulcher. But he rose on the third day, and he was seen alive. Rejoice evermore. That's the gospel. John 3.16 says, For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son, that whosoever believeth in him should not perish, but have everlasting life. It's reported that another black man unarmed has been shot and killed by police, Rayshard Brooks, at the age of 27. The scenario was he was getting late night food at a Wendy's, fell asleep in the drive through when other cars drove around and police shows up. They spoke to him, witnesses say 20 minutes and an altercation broke out. Rayshard and two other police officers fighting over a taser. They were trying to arrest him, whatever the case was. He was able to flee with the taser away from the cops when he was shot in the back. Uh, very sad stories happen too many times in America. But at the end of the day, we need to believe the gospel in order to go to heaven. And I pray you believe if you're listening. I pray he believed the gospel. That's the only way to go to heaven. John 1 12 says, but as many as received him, to them gave he power to become the sons of God. Even to them that believe on his name. The name is Jesus. Not Joshua, not Yeshua, but Jesus. Believe on him. That's how you go to heaven. You never know how we're going to lead this earth. Ephesians 2 and 8 says, For by grace are you saved through faith, and that not of yourself. It is a gift of God, not of works, lest any man should boast. Romans eleven twenty nine 29 says, For the gifts and calling of God are without repentance. So believe on Jesus. That's how you go to heaven. And we got to stop all this racial, unjust, racial profiling. All this stuff got to stop. Police brutality, all of it got to stop. We should love one another and believe the gospel, to be honest. Amen.